we we almost uh, wouldn't be a committee if it wasn't for Eminem. No. Nah. Mm. Because I remember, especially me and Matt, we uh, we basically bonded in that early period mm. 10 years ago on Relapse. Mm. Relapse was huge. Relapse got me into Eminem. And I just remember I, how many chats we'd have about best song on Relapse and how it was so underrated and it like it got so much hate for the accents, but he was... His rapping was flawless on that. On that, can you listen album. to it now from start to finish and go? This is a classic album. It's it is a classic album. There are songs now that I would skip probably. Mm. Like I used to really love "We Made You," mm. but I'd skip that now. Yeah. It's too it's too too much of a you know single, but it's like an imitation of the real Slim Shady and "My Name Is" like that type of single, but just done way worse. Is that his best album? Possibly. No, well, not maybe not objectively his best album, but subjectively, I love that album so much. Mm. It is, I reckon it's his best rapping he's ever done. Yeah. And the best production. Dr. Dre is on, like, the entire thing. Yeah. Banging. But, but yeah, Slim, Sh- Slim Shady LP, Marshall Mathers LP, um, Bad Meets Evil, the album, Relapse, Chuck Revival in the Garbage, <laughs> uh, Kamikaze's good. Recovery is meh. He's got a couple. He's got Encore a couple. Encore chucked that shit in the trash. Um, but yeah, overall, so so many good songs. 